Hello everyone and welcome to I am MS Excel Expert tutorial series. Today is day 34 and today we are actually going to write a code which will open up an Excel file from a folder. So if you are actually visiting my page for the first time, please subscribe to the channel and let's move forward. Okay, so we have this small exercise where I want to write a code which will actually open an Excel file from one personal folder and once I open that Excel file, I want to write in cell A1 that thanks for opening this file and then I want to save it and close the macro. So that's the plan. So let's start. I'll actually create one button again as, as I normally create and uh, I'll just write a code for that thing. I, I have something like that. I'll just, yeah, I have already here open Excel sub. I'll start writing here. So we have something called uh, workbooks dot open it's a inbuilt formula or kind of a you know functionality available with us so we'll use that along with that we'll, we are going to write the file name here so what is the file name and where is it located so that would be in double quote so uh, now I'm going to actually create one excel file somewhere on my desktop probably and uh, rename it uh, I'll rename it let's say you know day 34 uh, testing file so this is my file I'm going to take the uh, location of this file that would be in my desktop so I'll just take the location of my desktop write that in the file name and then I know the name of the file so that would be uh, if I refresh it probably it'll come yeah here it is so that's day 34 testing file along with the extension. So that would be XLSX would be my extension now. So this particular code which I have just written that will actually open up this particular file which we just created on my desktop. So once I actually open it I want to um, write thanks for opening this file in cell A1. So how I can do it? I'll say active workbook. Um, inside that I want to go to worksheets inside worksheet I want to actually write that in sheet 1 and inside that I want to go to range and that would be A1 and I want to write thanks for opening this file once I have written that I want to actually save this workbook workbook once I save it I want to close it as well right so this way um, if we have the sheet 1 in this new workbook which I have just created day 34 testing file so if you do not have I'll just cross check right now I'll go to my desktop and open this file actually I don't okay I'll just create one I'll delete this one so right now I, I can see that I have sheet one over here so right now it is actually blank in cell a1 I'll just save this and uh, I'll go to my macro here so right now we know that in my new workbook day 34 testing file has one sheet called sheet one in inside that I'll go and you know write thanks for opening this file in cell a1 so if I run this code, this will actually happen, save it and close it. Let's run it. So I just ran it and it's done. So let me cross check if I have that, you know, in cell A1, if, if thanks for opening the file is actually mentioned or not. So if I just go and double click over here, you can see that we have thanks for opening this file mentioned over here. That means my macro has worked. It has actually located this file from the desktop and open it up in cell A1 it has written thanks for opening this file and then save it so look like um, our macro is working fine so this is it for this class today guys so if you really like this video please hit the like button and comment on this video and if you're actually visiting for the first time please subscribe to the channel as well thank you so much bye bye